Compass recently completed a project for a defense contractor. The machine that we built automatically picks and torques thousands of screws into an antenna assembly. These antenna assemblies are upgrade components for older generation fighter jets. There are four different types of screws that are bowl fed and then picked up by a Fanuc M20 robot. An operator will place the cart into the cell um, with the assemblies in place. The robot then uses machine vision to check that those assemblies are correct with what is input um, through the HMI. The system then proceeds to torque those thousands of screws. After one operation is finished, one presentation, uh, the operator will remove the cart, add whatever parts are going to be added to the end antenna assembly next, uh, return the cart to the cell, and the system uh, proceeds with that next presentation. Eventually, after a number of presentations, the antenna assembly is complete, and we can move on to the next part. One of the main components of this machine is a DeSuter ERXS 50 torque driver. This driver is brand new. It was only recently introduced to the market, and our client got the first 100 production models available. Overall, we have several different types of operations that involve several different types of screws on totally different types of surfaces, so it's been a real challenge to make sure that the vision system can pick up on every single type of hole with every single type of finish that might be surrounding it, the different screw finishes, different screw types, all at the same time. The performance on it was amazing. One of the novel features of this machine was that the system was fully integrated into the customer's supervisory control and data acquisition system, or a SCADA system. This means that every torque value that the DeSuter driver picks up is sent back to a server that logs that data. That allows uh, an incredible amount of statistical process control that absolutely was not available um, when the process was done manually. Using the Agile technique, we were able to verify that all of these techniques were going to work long in advance of the actual manufacturing and assembly of the machine. That way, as soon as the machine was built, we already knew that we could find these holes with the camera and accurately bring the screwdriver right on top of these holes using DeSuter's driver and our Cognex vision system.